Hey, this is Mark with Manhattan Beach Studios. I'm here to offer a couple of tips when it comes to taking a great sports photograph. There are a couple of things that can really help and enhance your craft. So, here we go. Tip one, stay low. We want to make these athletes larger than life. And that's particularly hard for children. That's tip number one. Tip number two, your picture should be sharp. And that means in focus. Now there are some camera settings like servo mode that you want to pay attention to, but you really have to learn this. A great sports photograph starts with those eyes being in focus. Tip number three, shutter speed. In addition to being in focus, you need a fast enough shutter speed so that that athlete is frozen in time. That is essential to making sure that that picture looks professional and high quality and a pleasure to look at. Tip number four, follow the ball. Almost every great sports photograph with a ball has a ball in that photograph. So that takes anticipation, timing, planning, and an understanding of that sport. We'll talk more about that in the future. Next tip, eyes. Whether it's two eyes in a ball or four eyes in a ball, if there are two athletes, eyes are the window to the world. It's the soul, it's the emotion, the intensity. We want those eyes. That's what's going to give our sports photograph the ability to stand out. Tip number six, the defining moment. We want the moment that matters the most. So it's the actual shot. It's not the thing that happens before or the thing that happens later. We want the thing that matters most, the defining moment. Some photographers call this peak action. What we're looking for is the moment that defines everything. We want the shot, we want the save, we want the moment. We're not looking for the thing that happens before or the thing that happens after. So be ready, this is anticipation and knowledge of sport, but that's what we're looking for, the defining moment. Tip number seven, jubilation and dejection. We said a moment ago that we're not looking for what happens after the moment, but there's one key exception, emotion. The emotion of success, of jubilation, or of complete and utter sadness. That happens a fraction of a second sometimes after the moment is over. And we, as photographers, don't wanna take our eye off the camera until we capture everything meaningful on that field and that is one of the most important ways of standing out when it comes to sports photography moments. If you want to learn more about this there is a way. I've teamed up with Sports Illustrated photographer Peter Reed Miller and we're going to teach this stuff soup to nuts. Visit ManhattanBeachStudios.net. We'd love to see you.